I'm Candace, the Edgy Veg, your friendly vegan cookie monster, and today we're going to make peanut butter cookies. The most important ingredient for peanut butter cookies. You're going to need peanut butter. The second ingredient we're going to use is half a cup of Earthbound. You're slowly going to beat those two together while simultaneously adding three quarter cups of sugar. Joke break. Two peanuts were walking down the street. One was assaulted. So, when you're sick of mixing, take a break and add two tablespoons of molasses to your mixture. Now you want to make sure that you're using molasses or light molasses and not blackstrap molasses. And it may look like chocolate, but it sure as hell doesn't taste like chocolate, so don't taste this. We are also going to add one teaspoon of vanilla. Maybe a little bit more. A little bit of vanilla never killed anyone. Mix that until it's well combined. It's combined enough for me. Now we're going to add a cup and a quarter of flour, but add half first and then half later. Now to make these cookies bind together, you're going to need two tablespoons of cornstarch. And to make the cookies rise, you're going to need a quarter teaspoon of baking powder. And just like our assaulted peanut, we're going to add half a teaspoon of pink Himalayan rock salt, because table salt is crap. Now we're going to add the rest of our flour. There comes a point in every mixer's life where it just can't do any more work. So you have to get in with your hands. So you're going to want to mold these into walnut size, let's say a little bit bigger than walnut size balls. Balls. If it does not stick together, just add a little bit of water or your favorite non-dairy milk. We're gonna grease our pan today with a plastic bag and some earth balance. And there you have a greased pan, and your hands are clean. Now take your balls, balls, and lightly press them between your thumb and index finger, or two hands, and put them on a cookie sheet. Then you're going to take a fork, press it down one way, and then press it down the opposite way. Okay, so we have a pan of delicious, almost, peanut butter cookies. So we're gonna put this in the oven at 350 for about 10 minutes. There are many things that you can do while you wait. I like to practice my Tom Cruise samurai skills. So after 10 minutes, you want to take them out of the oven and let them cook for a little bit longer on the pan. So that will ensure that they're crispy on the outside but super, super soft on the inside. So after you've let them sit for about five to 10 minutes, you'll get something that looks like this. They're crunchy on the outside and soft on the inside. Now take them off and put them on a plate for your friends before you eat them all. I'm Candice, the Edgy Veg, and I want to know what your favorite cookies are. Leave me a comment below and make sure that you subscribe to Silk Current Studios. It's right up there. And be sure to follow me on Twitter. Bye.